Good day everyone, my name is Mary and for the first time ever my little tarantula Dora is going to eat a cockroach and I am extremely excited. Are you excited Layla? You look excited, what is with that face? Are you doing a poop right now? Possibly. So you might remember that when Dora was a tiny little baby I said something along the lines of one day she'll eat cockroaches but right now she's too small and she eats crickets. Well, she has now quadrupled in size from when we first got her and I just got in our first ever shipment of Dubia roaches and I'm super excited to open them up and see them and to give her one and I'm just very excited. This is a big day for our little Dora and it's just it's just so cool. I'm so excited. So Dubia roaches make an excellent feeder for lizards, tarantulas, all kinds of animals because they don't smell bad, whereas crickets have a pretty distinct negative smell, and they're easy to handle, and they don't require any kind of special living conditions. So I'm just opening up the box right now. I'm gonna be putting them into this cricket cage, just because it's what we have, but really any kind of containment would do for cockroaches. They they like a small space, they like lots of them in a small space. You know, it would be better if this was covered on the side so that they couldn't see out, that would make them feel safer as well. But seeing as I'm not trying to breed these dudes, I don't really mind. Well, they even have their own container, so I might not even need this. These are my dubias. Whoa, they're so cool. Get a nice good look at them, guys. Now this kind of cockroach is quite clearly different to your regular household cockroach. They're larger and flatter. This, this is what is considered the medium size. And this is the medium and there should be 100. And it also says open at your own risk, which is pretty funny. I actually have some friends who keep dubia roaches as pets because they're so easy to look after and they can get quite large and they're just kind of cool. But um, I know for a lot of you guys, you might be thinking that cockroaches, disgusting, oh my god. <laughs> so I'm going to attempt to get out one roach with my hand and I'm going to then drop that into Dora's enclosure because now that she's got her really big enclosure, I can't just bring it over here to the kitchen countertop. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pick up, I'm gonna pick up one of these cockroaches with my hand. Here are my little roach friends. There they are, focus camera. I think that little guy on top is probably gonna be the one. Oh man, oh they just keep walking around the corner. Oh, see they're pretty cute. I almost feel bad feeding them off. Look at him coming around the corner. Oh, with his little antennae. Oh buddy. All right, I gotta pick one of you guys up and it's probably gonna be you, cutie pie. I'm sorry, no? You don't wanna be picked up, do you? Little scamps. Oh, you're little. You'd be, you'd be good for Dora. Okay. Oh, I just gotta be brave and do it. There we go. All right, got one. I got a roach. Okay, and now I need to close the lid. Okay, I have my cockroach in my hand. Okay, here's Dora's enclosure. There's the roach on my finger. I don't want to flick you down and hurt you, but you gotta, you gotta go meet your friend Dora, who's gonna eat you. Oh, I feel bad. He's cute but everything's gotta eat to live. All right, little man. Okay, he's down, he's in, and Dora is all the way at the back there, and I'll get my phone that has the light on it so you guys can see. First, I'll close the top. Even though Dora is not an arboreal tarantula, I still wanna close the top just in case. Oh, cockroach has already gone in. All right, so there's Dora back there. And our little roach friend is right there. When she sees that cockroach moving, she's gonna run towards it, but he's hidden himself. Oh, that cockroach is not gonna move. He's gonna sit right there, and Dora's not gonna see him until he moves. Hmm, the predicament. Okay, I washed my hands so I could pick Layla up. So far, Mr. Roach has not moved. He is hiding in his little crevice. And, uh, crevice, I said that really weird. Crevice, like Travis and Dora has not seen him yet, but I'm gonna stay close so that I can film and hopefully we'll be able to get it on camera. Hey, Layla. Hey. All right, Dora's moved. She's over there now. I can no longer see the roach, but I can't see it in her mouth, so I don't know if she's actually eaten it or not yet. It's super difficult to see inside of her little cave. Yeah, I'm sorry, Layla. 
I put you down so I could try and see if Dora ate her roach. Such a mean mum putting you down, huh? I shouldn't have done that. Gotta hold you forever. Nyam, 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 nyam. Oh, you don't want to be numbed? You don't want to be numbed right now? <laughs> You're the sweetest little baby. Come on, Ben. Drink again. You're being so cute. I guess I was too slow. Oh my goodness, one of our cockroaches is albino. Oh my goodness, that is so amazing. Oh, I'm not even, I'm not even gonna let Dora eat that one. That one's just a pet. Oh, what should we name her? Oh, that's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Well, maybe not the cutest thing ever, but pretty flippin' cute. What should I name be? Mm, snowball. There you go. Snowball the Dubia Roach. Oh, oh, so cute and so special. <laughs> they have so many little roachy roaches. Oh, you want one? Ugh, look at all the dirt in that corner lunchbox. Yucky, that needs to be cleaned. So Dora did eat, but we didn't get to see it because it's so hard to see in there. She's right, right at the back of her enclosure right now. But yep, she ate, it was exciting. I'm sorry that I couldn't get it on film. Hey Mary, mm -hmm. you excited? Yeah. Why are you excited? Because the snake ate. Oh, <laughs> yes, I'm excited because Pancake ate her food. Benjamin did not, but Pancake did. Yeah. So that means that everyone, aside from Ben, is all up to date. Yeah, everybody's eating except for Ben, baby. How you feel about that? Oh, Papa. Oh, my Papa. She's gonna go feed Greta. Can we watch? Can we watch you feed Greta? Sure. Come on up. Yeah, I bet you coming too. All right. Woo! Come on up, party people! You can do it, Betty. You can do it. Yeah. Now, right in front of our enclosure here, you can see there are some urates. Oops. Yeah, I was gonna clean them up yesterday, but then I was gonna feed her, and I didn't yeah. want to clean it and feed her on the same day. Snake, snake, snake. What's that? What's that? Whoop, whoop. My hands are a lot warmer than the rest. Yum, 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 yum. You did it. You didn't know, Betty. Don't rub your face all on the carpet. Don't do it. <laughs> Don't do it. Papa. All right, you enjoy that, Randy. Papa, come on. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Party people. Oh, the wall is crooked here. Oh. Let's go. Let's go downstairs, Betty. Yeah, Betty. Down the stairs. Oh, bless you. Bless you. Bless your face. You just sneeze for step. <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you guys very much for watching this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Oh, next time we're probably going to be a different camera, maybe one that can focus on faces. But I like the color of this camera, it's really good. Oh well. Anyway, just smelling, you smelling the baby? Alright, baby. Say bye, everybody. See you next time. Stay toasty. Bye.